Hi everyone, welcome to your app tutorial. For people who are new, there is a link first in the description box. You have to click that and then now let's begin. Okay, so this is what I use for astrology. This is uh, something that's going to help everybody and this is our basic tutorial for now. We're going to start it step by step. It is available in Android. It is available on both OS, so ISO, Android. Okay. You get to your app store. You put it, once you get to the app, okay, once after you click the link, you start downloading it. Hi everyone, welcome. <laughs> Everybody went wild and crazy yesterday. Okay, so um, with the codes, let's explain first. Of course, it's going to be the first person who will be able to use it. It will expire right after. Okay. So, I mean, I clearly stated there, but for people who just went quietly, okay, let's, let's get down to the basic. Okay. So, for this uh, series of videos, there's going to be a code. Now, this time, it's just one code flying somewhere in the video, and you can get the reading for free, the extended reading for free. Because you have been constantly watching and you're always in the premiere. Makes sense. So, you know, so because if you are not on premiere, then you're going to miss out. All okay? right. So make sure you're always hitting the bell and you're always on point. Because as soon as that code flies, one person can only use it. And you have to use it in the checkout, not in the comments. Okay. So, so it's, you know, that's it. It expires after. Okay. So is that clear? Okay. <laughs> Um, make sure you download the app. I'll be doing tutorial how to get the birth chart. That's what you've seen. Follow all the way to the end and download the app that I'm using so we can learn, th uh, we can learn together because I'll be launching a, a wonderful uh, class pretty soon. Okay. So you have to have it so we can discuss what your chart means for you. Okay. So it's going to be a very interactive, uh, class. Now, anything else? 21 and 28. If you want to catch me live. I'll be live on Saturday, which is the 21st, and then another Saturday, the 28th. It's back to back to back. No, that's back to back only. Okay. This is not ASAP. Okay. <laughs> back to back. Okay. Um, webinar about entrepreneurship, which is going to be very lovely because we'll be looking at Jupiter, Planet of Happiness, Mercury, uh, merchandise and business, okay, abundance for Jupiter, together with how I started the channel. And, you know, who knows? Maybe you're the next big thing that's going to come out to this wonderful world that we have. Okay, so that's that. Um, anything else? Um, I think that's it. And for the codes, you should also follow me on Instagram. I release codes there, another code right there, and email lists. Okay, so go to my website, eatreadlove.me, because we release also code. Those are separate codes, though. One-time use. Again, separate codes for those. Okay, so Salviadora for my IG, for my email list, because I will release also um, how to call it, prediction in the email list soon. I'm just working on it, because we know we like to keep things busy and happy in this channel. Okay, so I wish everybody well, and let's start with your reading. Hi, Sagis. So let's start your reading. How are you? <laughs> I look like a teacher. Can I be like a guru? If you know, you know, gurus is way up there. Okay, gurus are way up there. They're never here. Okay, so let's start your reading here. Messengers are here. Yahoo Messenger. Yahoo Messenger. What year are you from? How are you? So let's start your reading. Um, if you see the code flying somewhere, then remember it's one person. Okay. How hard is it to listen to Sal? If you can't listen to me, how can we make the reading manifest? <laughs> so, so let's see. You and the other person, okay? Here and there, you can always switch it depending on the angle. The good angle, I always choose myself, okay? So let's see here for my Sagis. Okay, let's see here. Let me see. Sagis, Sagis. Here we go. Okay, your greatest competitor. Oh, sorry. My phone was on. It was an email. Or it's an... Oh, okay. <sighs> okay, those are just... Uh, um, mm. King of Cups. No, it's just another business. Like, nothing to be worried. 
um, King of Cups. So your competitor is a Scorpio, so you could be, <laughs> how to say this. I know Mula does not go to Sag, I mean to Scorpio, but you know, you're the Mula Nakshatra. But sometimes you guys resonate on that part also, with the Sag. Um, is this you? I feel like it's you. Okay, this is you. You are ready. So, yay for the cross watcher because the Sag is ready. <laughs> That's what they're saying. Okay. That the King of Cups is ready to express themselves. I mean, why not, Sag? Why not? Okay. So, I've been expressing myself from day one, so I don't know what you're talking about. Got it? <laughs> well, I just feel like you should right now. Okay. Right now. You're never shy of your feelings anyway, right? Mm. Being direct. There's three kinds of Sag, okay? So you can have generous. And then after that, there's Padas also. You know? There's the Nakshatra first. Go there, divide that into three, and then divide the four. You know, the four Padas. Mm. So don't give me cosmopolitan that all Sagis are the same. Meaning, some Sagis are Venusian. Mm -hmm. Would you believe that? Um, Purvashada is the Nakshatra of Venus. And you're a Sag. Imagine that. You never thought that you're Venusian. Mm. This is all about love. So if you're a Sag who's all about love, then you have a poor Vashala. Mm -hmm. But more on the calculative side. See? That's why you don't share it. Yes, I will when I'm ready. Mm. You have to go to the degrees. You want to know yourself? Stop, watch. Stop reading Cosmopolitan Horoscope. Yes? Okay. Mm. So the reason why you don't open up easy, even though you love the person already, Sag, is because you want to go down to the bottom of it. The King of Cups gets down to the bottom of love also. Mula Nakshatra. The root. Yes. So don't expect all Sag to be the same. Mm. Mm. Never. It's like a fingerprint. So. Justice card. When the moment is right, and this is Venusian. Mm, calculative, I told you. Your logic and also your intuition. Logic is a sword, intuition is in the other hand. It's a merchandise. It's not about balance. It's about what do you put in the table and what the other person can take and the same vice versa. So it is never about balance. Mm. It's about the trade. If I'm ready to open up, what does it mean for the other person? This is what you're thinking. If I open up, what does it mean for the other person? Are they going to open up? Because if not, then no. I keep myself to myself. Four of Pentacles. Yes? Okay. So make sure you download the app so you stop believing in Cosmopolitan. Love good magazine though. Maybe for fashion, chit chat, article. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But if you're still believing in Cosmo, then it's a flipper. Okay. You'll never know yourself for this lifetime. It's such a waste. Mm. Got a Three of Swords and a Death card because you, you were hurt in the past, Sag. You were hurt. It's not easy to open up after you have trampled someone's feelings, after you get betrayed, after that you have a heartache. Mm -hmm. And I told you, you could be dealing with a Scorpio. You have a Scorpio in your chart. When I say you have a Scorpio in your chart, it doesn't mean like, oh, sun and Scorpio. No. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. It has to be either your sun and your moon. Okay? Or Rahu together. That makes a strong sign. If ascendant and moon. Mm. So clearly, you're coming out of a phase. You were in love once, but you're one of those, uh, you know, live long enough to be a villain. You know, either you die a hero, which you have died for this person, death card with a justice, right? You die as a hero, which you did, or live long enough to be a villain. Three of Swords. That's how Sag normally is. They become a heartbreaker. Because if they got hurt by one, and they just started now to think everybody is just the same, so might as well just have fun. I was never treated seriously, so why would I treat them serious? Mm -hmm. Let's see. The temperance, because someone wants to take you seriously right now. Someone on this side, remember this, this side, is thinking about you every time, through and through. Will of fortune and the temperance. So, should I say that it's the X? Should I say that? Because mm -hmm. the temperance with the Wheel of Fortune, this only shows that it is someone from the past. 
waiting for things to get back, to be back together. Mm -hmm. And this one wants to come out. And just waiting. See, I told you. Waiting for you. Waiting for things to go around in favor. Are they welcome in your life? We don't know. We don't know yet. The temperance only shows here they're being patient. Mm -hmm. Because this is also healing. So if you need to heal because they betrayed you, then they're going to give you that space. But they're looking for this. They're looking for Jupiter's happiness. Mm -hmm. Jupiter is a savior, which we always do, right? Ever wonder, especially, of course, this is only for ascendants, okay? Or moon, or Jupiter in the first house can be. Why you always have the divine saving grace? It's because of Jupiter. Out of all the planets, there's one planet that can save you out of everything. Because it's the most benefic planet, Jupiter. That's why people say you're so lucky, because Jupiter is luck, ninth house. Fifth house is also luck, which is Leo, but Jupiter is way more than that, because Jupiterian is God, basically. Their sun, fifth house, is our soul, and then there's fifth house. I mean, there's set ninth house. Let's see. You got a seven of wands and a five of cups. You have restricted this person from interacting with you. It's what we call safe distancing right now. Yes. Seven of Wands with a Five of Cups. They're upset because you're not open for any kind of communication. Oh, so now you're the one who's upset. How about the Sag is not upset, but hurt? Mm-hmm. Just saying. I do burn. Especially if you have a Mula Nakshatra because you just say it. Not all Sagis are sarcastic. I don't know why I keep differentiating. Probably a lot of the new ones, probably who's not who's new to this channel, is still with a cosmopolitan. Yeah? Mm -hmm. Mm. You're never dealing with the same sign also. We're both sun sign. That does that means zero. That means zero. 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 Mm -hmm. And you'll get annoyed because I will be annoying. <laughs> Pretty and simple. So I'm annoyed by you, Sal. Yeah, because that's the point, for me to be annoying. Then congratulations. Okay. People get annoyed. Mm -hmm. Get a life. Chariot with a page of cups and a nine of cups. You're moving forward with your life. Someone wants to message you because you're happy. This is you, not them. This is you. Because you're doing amazing now. Yucker water sign. Mm, can be. Mm -hmm. Let's see. Three of Cups, thinking that they can be wi winning you back. Strength card is a Leo and a Page of Wands. Thinking, okay, that they can squeeze you to talk to them. That they have the courage to squeeze this out of you. Because what are they doing is just moping and waiting for you to come out. So they're going to be still, okay, waiting there, waiting there, waiting there. But thinking about you, thinking about you, and wanting you. So let them soak. Because they're a termisu. Like a coffee liquor. Uh -huh. And the saviardi. Mm -hmm. The lady fingers. Okay? So keep moving forward, Sag. Keep moving forward. I know they want you, they desire you so much. Okay? But they're trying to squeeze for you to come back and to stay. Are you a squeezed cheese? Because they're squeezing you. No. Okay, so that's good. Keep going. Okay, so follow me all the way to the extended preview. If you see the code somewhere, make sure you also comment below, right? Okay, so I'll see you guys again. The two apps is down there. Thank you very much, guys, for watching. Bye. Think. This is what you're having. You need time to think. Hangman with the Six of Pentacles. You're not going to reach out. Not that easy. Six of Swords and the Ten of Wands. This person is a mess, okay? Because uh, they feel like this relationship is a burden. You better make the move. Because they're waiting for you. They're going to manipulate you to go. So I don't think that you should be. Because the sun is you. Okay. So this is your home screen. And it says there, get started. You click that. You click next. Next. You have your 360 birth analysis. Real time insight using modern astronomy and ancient astrology. You have everything you need to plan your day. Okay. 
and then you can also keep track of friends family and clients so this is not just an app for the uh, you know it's an app for the hobbyist and also for the professional and then you click got it you click turn on notification okay. and then okay. you allow notification okay we have a lot of things here <laughs> Okay, you gotta set your primary location. So, right now it's Los Angeles. Okay. So now that you are in your home screen, you're gonna sign up for a new account. I'm gonna put here your John Doe. John Doe. I'm gonna put your email address. John Doe. You're gonna put all your information, your your time, place of birth, and once you're all set up with your all your personal information, you click create. And then there you have it. Now you are already logged in and you have successfully downloaded the app. Once you have fulfilled all those um, requirements of the app when you were signing up, you can now go to your chart. You can choose South Indian, North Indian, East Indian. I use South Indian. And then there it is, John Doe. You can now see all the placement. When you click to your chart and you see it over there, you're gonna see your ascendant your sun sign your moon sign all the planetary positions in each houses you will see also the corresponding degrees at the same time on the right side and also the nakshatra and now you have it and that's the first step of downloading the app